Most of it was I got introduced to a certain type of technology at an earlier age, whether it was an iPhone, that's how I got into doing short films just around town in front of my house. And then music, I was gifted a MacBook at the beginning of high school. I was told to only do, you know, productive stuff on there. The first thing I did was download my script writing software and GarageBand at the time. Really just dove into it and just tried to learn it, just was trying to have fun with it. And for a while, music was just something that I was learning for fun, never took any like classes really. For a while, I've been trying to find a through line. I feel Imaginary Friends is able to help me find that through line by allowing me to use all my skills in one place, almost in the role of a creative director, which is what I'm looking to work towards and I feel that that's a way for me to keep in touch with all the different skills that I've already worked so long to, to build and through music, visual arts, and maybe even visual arts that I haven't explored yet. Right now, working on a couple different musical projects, some for myself, different genres, and some with Mark on his upcoming project. I have an electronic project that I'm wrapping up and trying to, trying to get out in the world. I've been holding on to ideas for a while and just trying something new. Definitely I've been inspired by Mark and Rob to produce things that are outside of hip-hop. I normally am a hip-hop producer, but I am really trying to expand the different genres that I feel like I can attack with, uh, with confidence.